In this lesson, I'll be teaching you an ancient way to multiply numbers known as the Galley method, or you might have heard it as the latest method. It's the same thing. Now remember, this method was used before calculators were invented. And while you probably know how to multiply numbers by hand, think of this as a simpler way of doing it. At least to me it is. Let me show you how it works. So let's say we want to multiply 685 with 49. You take the first number that you are multiplying and write it down horizontally, as you would normally. 6, 8, 5. And leave some spaces in between each number. The other number gets written down vertically. So you see this 49? We write it down vertically on the right side. Then we create a rectangle. So I'll create a rectangle. And this rectangle will have three columns and two rows. You see? We have three columns now, and by placing this line, we now have two rows. Next, what we do is create diagonals. So starting from this corner, we will create a diagonal that passes through these points, a line that passes from here to here, another from here to here, and finally one more through there. And this is where it gets its name from. A galley is essentially a boat that is powered using paddles. And this is the ancient type of boat as you can see on your screen. Okay, the reason why we do that is because we now multiply six and four, that's 24. So the 20 is the tens place value, we put it right here, and the four, the ones place value goes in that corner. Eight times four is 32, five times four is 20, nine times six is 54, and you get the idea. 9 times 8 is 72, and 45. The reason why we split it up into diagonals and rectangles is because now we will add diagonally. So 5 plus nothing else along its diagonal is 5. 2 plus 4 is 6. 2 plus 2 plus 7 plus 4. 2 plus 2 is 4, plus 4 is 8, plus 7 is 15 we write down five and carry the one to the next diagonal. So we have one that we got from this diagonal plus three, plus four, that's eight, plus five, it's 13. Again, we carry the one for this last place. We have two plus one is three. The answer, the product to these two is 33,565. That's a lot better than doing it the traditional way in my opinion. Let's do one more example for good measure. This time we have 512 times 7. It's a little easier, of course. 512 and 7 along the vertical. We will create a rectangle like this. And we will separate it. We have three columns in one row. Again, we will create the diagonals like we did before. OK. 7 times 2 is 14. 7 times 1 is 7, so keep this area as 0. There's no tens value for that product, 1 times 7. 7 times 5 is 35. We now go ahead and add the diagonals. We have 4, here is 8, 5 plus 0 is 5, and that 3. The answer to this is 3,584. And so there you have it, two examples on how to multiply using the galley method.